No, why am I hungry? Now, oh, I'm gonna die. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Why, hello there, my friends, and welcome to a brand new Minecraft Let's Play series. That's right, series, multiple episodes, stretching on and on into infinity. My name is The Elementalist, and I look forward to working with all of you. This here is a random seed, although I will not lie to you. I have had a bit of a peek before starting the recordings of this episode, and that mountain right there, my friends, looks beautiful. That, I think, is the perfect place for us to live. Nice area, there are some jungles over there, lots and lots of birch and oak, and even a savanna in that direction. I think there's an ocean over beyond that way. That was a mistake starting out brand new. We'd have no food and very little health at all. Let's see what we can get up to, shall we? Well, just like every other Minecraft survival game, we gotta start by punching a tree a couple of times because we need some tools and we need, I think, at least three of these if I can math correctly. Let's see. Break that down. Make a crafting table. Make some sticks. Yeah, see, just two. Would have left me with two blocks left, and I can't make a pickaxe with just two of those. Or an axe, for that matter. Do we make an axe? We've got a floating tree. I don't care about an axe. We need a block. I don't care about an axe. We need to break down this tree first. The whole thing. We can't leave any floating blocks in this world. No. No, we cannot. This world is too perfect for something like that. And that is the first tree chopped down of this series of this game of this world now I am going to let you all know that this is a season two for me I did a season one about a year ago now where we started it maybe a little over a year ago and it's been quiet for a while but I'm looking forward to this series so much I've missed Minecraft I've missed Minecraft a tremendous amount whoa that's um that, that's like epilepsy. I really hope none of you guys have, have, have seizures. Well, okay, if we have a wooden pickaxe, we're just going to use this momentarily, right? I just need three pieces of cobblestone. There we go. Yep, our first advancement of this game, of this world. We can do that. We can do that. I'm going to convert those into stone. As, into stone? Those are sticks, you silly nana. Well, now that we have a stone pickaxe, I'm going to go ahead and chop a couple bits more of these because we need to make the rest of our starter tools. There we go. I think that's all we're going to need. I'm going to go ahead and chop that guy in there. We don't need wooden tools anymore, my friends. Never again. But now, I really like that there's bamboo over there. Now we get to go exploring a little bit. I'm thinking that mountain, right? That is such a beautiful flat picturesque mountain right there. Also, my fog is turned off. That looks so much better with a little bit of fade in the background at the periphery. I want to move over to that mountain, as I was about to say, but um, my food is already getting a little low. I've got some seeds, so we'll be able to start a wheat farm pretty quickly. But before I go there, I think I'm going to grab some acacia wood and acacia saplings. I like building with this wood, surprisingly enough. Um, and while we're down here, we might as well grab a couple and then head on over to our, at the very least, our little starter home area on that mountain. There we go. I've got some acacia wood and I've got a couple of acacia saplings with me. I think the rest I'll be able to get up there or at the very least at the jungle next to it. But yes, hello, welcome to my new survival Minecraft Let's Play series. First off the bat, uh, I'm assuming a lot of you are new because my channel has grown a little bit since my last Minecraft series. Uh, Minecraft is actually my primary game. It is the one I prefer to play, although I do play a little bit of Ark. Uh, but for those of you who are new here who do not know me as a Minecrafter, I am a builder, predominantly. I like building pretty things. 
You can go ahead and check out any number of the episodes from my previous Let's Play series. I'll link that in the description and up in the cards and the stuff, the things like that. For any of you who are interested, um, I'm a builder predominantly. I like a bit of redstone here and there. And um, this is not a hardcore Let's Play because I am far too clumsy to trust myself with a hardcore Let's Play. I will die, probably in this episode still. So, oh boy, speak of the devil, it is becoming night. Um, sheepies, I am so sorry, but um, I, I need to make a bed. Come here, come here, please come here. All right, and you guys saw absolutely none of that, right? Right? I'm an idiot. I just made slabs. I can't play Minecraft anymore. It's been so long. Ah, bed. Bed. Are we alive? Are we still alive? Are there zombos burning? Nope, no zombos, no no skelebobs, no okay, great. Bed, hello. It has literally been months since I last recorded anything remotely Minecraft related. So I am a little out of practice. I hope you can all forgive me. Let's climb a mountain, shall we? I wanna see what's up there. Oh, free coal! Don't mind if I do. Quite a bit of free coal. Even better. Now, while I may have a little bit of coal, I don't have very much food. I do have an axe, though. And I'm pretty sure there are some animals, preferably piggies, around here that um, I'm probably not going to need. Hey, okay, that is our first little bit of food, and just in the nick of time, I was on one last little haunch. I had to go around and kill enough pigs. And I'm sorry for that if anyone got offended by it, but it's just a game. I had to go around and kill enough pigs just in order to get enough to warrant the making of a furnace to cook food with. Because I don't just want to make a furnace and then cook, you know, five pieces of mutton. No, it's like half a stack. That lost me a little while at least. So I had been thinking that here, with this view, would be our starter house area, right? We'd build it here, roughly where this dirt is. I had three pieces of stripped acacia log placed down to mark this spot because I like a jungle, you know? It looks really good with all the tall trees and, and the bright green vibrant grass. But then I realized that if you look a little bit to the left, you get the area where we spawned, which is not jungle, right? That grass, and I unfortunately don't have zoom, I don't use Optifine, I have sodium. But um, th that's just regular grass over there. And if you come this way just a little bit, you also just get regular grass. Now I don't mind regular grass, but I, what I do mind is this color transition, right? On the left of my cursor, is this bright vibrant green which is beautiful and on the right of this cursor is the regular grass which is perfectly fine just not quite the same grass and I don't want to build with that transition right in my view so instead now that all of my pork chops have finished cooking I'm gonna go ahead and grab my little starter camp setup thing here and yes I use the shovel to break a bed leave me alone and we're gonna run in the opposite direction. So the jungle is over there, right? You can just kind of see it through there. But we're gonna run away from the jungle. Not because I don't like the jungle. My friends, I love the jungle. But with the jungle to our back, my friends, there is more to work with here. This is just the other end of that same big flat plateau-y mountain thing that I really like and that I want to build on top of. But over here, it kind of gradually goes down into a flatter area. Now, yes, there are a ton of trees down there, but in my head, I envision sprawling fields and farmlands and little farming homesteads down there. Doesn't that just sound beautiful to you? I think it sounds wonderful. So, I think we can go ahead and reset up our little base camp area right here. 
and this is probably going to be where where we're going to call you know home for a little while at least um, we might expand we might build bigger houses not might no no not might my friends this is not a might series this is a do series we are going to expand and build bigger better starter homes and houses and things i'm gonna need that and that uh, but for now i think we can just plop down these things here make ourselves some torches because i need to go and gather a whole bunch of materials after i sleep because the sun is setting the sun is always setting in this game what um yes we're gonna go gather some resources i might clear out some space break some of these trees down maybe farm some more of these acacia trees and once we have resources i think it's going to be very important to get a little starter house going for this episode still some trees chopped some saplings planted in nice neat rows for future choppage and a cave identified not too far from our little base camp area i think it's time i have fresh tools I have a whole bunch of pickaxes. I've got a brand new axe because I broke my first one. I think it's time to come and explore. And we can get, yep, Monster Hunter by killing our very first spooder and a creeper. Explodey boy. You, sir, need to die. You could die. Die, die. No, 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 no. I want to die you. Thank you. Cave. Okay. Um, We have no armor whatsoever I see coal I see co I see iron beautiful beautiful absolutely gorgeous let's grab this and we're one step closer I think I would like to in this episode if possible get up to diamond tier armor not necessarily enchanted in any way shape or form but at the very least get the armor made um, because well I need deep slate that's that's the primary resource I'm going to be hunting for and at deep slate level you know I might as well go looking for diamonds while I'm there so we're gonna do that first though I'm gonna grab all this coal all this XP all this food cooking material and um, see if I can find some more iron maybe get up to iron tier first you know make things go a little faster I have run into a tiny problem in that I have explored this whole cave. It is not very big. It just makes a loop down here and then it comes right back through here. Same cave. Um, so I'm out of cave and I have nearly a stack of coal. Not a lot more iron than when you last saw me, but it's nighttime. Um, it, it's very, very dark out there, and I don't think I want to go out into that garb- ah, That cow nearly gave me a heart attack. Uh, so, instead, I think- I really like this this cave entrance, right? That's kind of right there, next to where my starter house is going to be. I see absolutely no reason why this cannot be a mine entrance, and we can decorate it and make it all purdy and all that, and um, I can just make a tunnel going straight down to- diamond level right right i think that's a brilliant idea whose stupid idea was it to start a mine on level 100 and something it's gonna take me forever i've already gone through two and a half pickaxes and um oh, i've got over three stacks of cobblestone which is great i suppose i'm gonna throw that in there i'm gonna might as well start smelting up some of this cobblestone Dog! I don't have bones, but you will be mine. Um, let's go ahead and make up two more of these so that I can smelt up more cobblestone. But I came up here basically just so that I can make more pickaxes because I don't want to have to worry about night falling while I'm down here because I'm down there. Because I'm going to be down there for quite a while at a time. Need one more. Um, so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna make a bunch of pickaxes, go back down there, and spend quite a while down there, I think. So let's see, all of that, into that. Uh, how many pickaxes do you guys think I'm gonna need? 
I'm thinking that's probably gonna be enough. And I have two iron pickaxes. Basically all of the iron I had, I have two ingots and five more pieces left. Um, for when I get down to deep slate level, because there's no way I'm digging through deep slate with stone pickaxes. No, 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 no. The chest is also in my inventory for emptying my inventory, you know, because that, that's going to become important, especially if my inventory is full of pickaxes. I mean, that makes perfect sense, doesn't it? I think so. I definitely overestimated how many pickaxes I would need because I'm already in deep slate level and already onto my iron pickaxes, but I found a cave. Um, I am terrified of this cave and have absolutely no idea how I'm supposed to get down into it. Before I go down into it though, I think I'm going to hop back up here and I've just been doing this. I've been going down 10, turn 180, 10, 10, so on and so forth. And this whole thing still needs to be taller so that, you know, you don't bump your head and I can put stairs in. And it's also going to be wider, too wide, just because, you know, I can. Uh, but all of this stuff, I'm going to go ahead and dump in there. Actually, give me a stack of that. Building blocks are important. Uh, probably don't need all of those. Something like uh, so. And now I need to figure out how to get in there without killing myself. Ooh, ooh, I see shiny. No, 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 no. I see shiny though. Dang it. Uh, now what? I would like shiny. But Skelly Bob is um, probably going to be an issue for me. More Skelly Bobs and Creepers. Oh boy. Um. Okay, how do we do this then? Oh, no, 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 no. What? How dare you, sir? How dare you? Also, Lapis. Um, I have absolutely no idea how I'm supposed to do this. Dang it. No, ow! He's gonna shoot me down into there. This is bad. This is very, very bad. Um... Iron! Yay! Iron is good. Iron means armor and or tools. A good amount of iron too. Cool. Okay. It, uh... I'm gradually moving downward, very, very gradually here. I can do that, that, that. Cool. Now, technically, that is access to the down there. However, um, the down there is rather dangerous right now. So I'm thinking that uh, instead of going to the down there right now, I am going to go back up to the surface. It's a long climb up there. I'm going to take some of these resources with me. I'm going to see if it's night or day or what have you. And um, smelt up all of the rest of the iron that I have and see how many pieces of armor, maybe a diamond axe as well, I can make. Did I say diamonds? I don't have diamonds. I meant an iron axe just to do a bit more damage. So I did not, in fact, make an iron axe because all axes deal the same amount of damage, I think. At the very least, a stone axe and, a, and an iron axe deal the same damage. So I just made a spare stone axe for when this one breaks. And I'm going to use an axe, a stone axe, as my main 
offensive weapon for now. Instead, I got boots! I made a chest plate, and then what I had left would either have gone into an iron axe or I got boots! I only had four pieces, so no pants. But boots! I see the shiny. I also see the spooder eyes. Uh, and the creepers. And the skeletons! No! Did it see me? I don't know that it saw me. It will see me eventually. I should probably stop being such a big coward and just, um, go and deal with it. Iron! Oh no, the creepy boom boom. Ah! <laughs> run, run, run! Torch up the whole place, everything! Everything within sight! No, spooters! Spooters are not chasing. Is there gravel up there? I mean, that could be a trap. I, I could make a trap. I, I don't know how. I don't think I'm smart enough for a trap right now, but... Redstone? I mean, I could just whack it from up here and drop all the... Oh, anyway. I see more iron! Let's grab the iron! Um... And then I think I'm just going to go for a free run down there and just place as many torches as I possibly can. Run away again, come back, and hopefully the torches will have prevented anything from respawning after... Diamonds! The shinies! Oh, the shinies I didn't even have to cut! I am screaming internally right now because I cannot scream into my microphone without hurting your ears. But diamonds! Yay! Our first diamonds of the series! Boop! Only three? Oh, 1.18 made it so much harder to get diamonds! That's okay though. Three diamonds is a very good start. That's a diamond pickaxe. That is gorgeous. Uh, one thing I did realize though is that if I want to do diamond armor efficiently this episode, I'm gonna have to get into some enchanting at least a little bit in order to get a diamond pickaxe with fortune or something on it. Maybe? Possibly? Hopefully? Do we bother? I don't know. Hmm. Anywho, free-for-all run. Uh, I need to light up this place, make it kinda semi a little bit spawn-proof and then run away and come back. Yep, that's gonna be the plan. Hi, Mr. Boom Boom, please don't, don't, nope, no, 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 no. Okay, he, he did not go boom, he did. Why are there more? Hi, booms. There's a spawner down here? I need to run. No standing still. No, why am I hungry? Now, oh, I'm gonna die. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Intense focus. So much. I ran out of torches. Oh boy. Uh, no, 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 no. Oh, it's dark up here too. No, no, no. Didn't blow up. All right. Come on, Mr. Zombie. Let's do this. Okay, dead Zombert. Do not blow up. Aha! I am the very best. You know, that went surprisingly smoothly. Honestly, I was not expecting that to go quite as... I see more shinies over there! Yay! Uh, this is good. This this is all... Where are you? Up there, probably. Um... Okay, this is good. Is it just gonna be the one? With my luck, it's just one diamond. 
It's definitely just one. Gosh darn it. Well, we're four diamonds richer than we were. Possibly five, maybe even more than five over there. Um, I want to... There's a creeper. Mr. Creeper, I would like to go in there. Do not blow up and just see what kind of spawner that is. It's... Oh, it's a skeleton spawner! It's a skeleton spawner that is the best kind of spawner. Will you die? Thank you. It is a skeleton spawner. Happy days! We're not tackling this this episode, but we are definitely tackling it in the next episode. That is glorious. That is so great. Uh, none of that's really worth it right now. I'll leave those there. We got a golden apple though, and um, what do you guys think of my new hairstyle? I think I dig it. More diamonds! Yay! I'm just running around lighting things up and I find more! Happy days! Gimme more, gimme more, gimme more, more, more... No more? That's just not fair. Oh well, it's another diamond! I've run out of torches, but I think it's relatively safe. It's a lot safer than it was before I came in here. So now I think I can just go around... Nothing over here? No? Uh, and collect every diamond I see, every bit of iron I see, every bit of coal that I see. And then I think we'll head back up. Yep, diamond. Give me another. Oh, come on. Just one? That really sucks. Um, head back up, deposit our valuables, and um, continue our tunnel down to proper diamond level because we're still a little bit high up I think. I have a lot of trees growing up around me but that's good because we're gonna need some wood. I've also made the journey down to... wait 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 wait... down to that river to grab some water and I brought back two buckets of it so I now have a water source up here. Yes! Achievements, advancements, progress and um, oh yeah I planted some some seeds, so yay! For now, though I've not done any more work, I still have my crap ton of pickaxes in my inventory, uh, that is not enough cobble deep slate for us. So we're gonna go back in there. I'm not gonna use the diamonds just yet, I don't have enough levels to craft or to, to enchant anything in any case, so those are gonna stay there for now. Um, I have a whole bunch of iron pieces, so I'm gonna go ahead and make myself a full set of iron armor. You know, I'm, I'm just missing the two pieces. A little more protected. And I'm thinking... I'm gonna go ahead and make two more iron pickaxes. Because why not? You know? Yeah, you know, you know. And more diamonds! I'm not even down to where I wanna be, but I got more diamonds. I'll never say no to that. Oh, and it's more than one! Yay! <laughs> more than two? I don't think I'm gonna be that lucky. I got spares! Nope, I'm not gonna be that lucky. Well, two diamonds! Happy days! Hey yo! I'm finally at the level where I want to be for diamonds, and I've been mining a little bit. I'm on my last iron pickaxe, and actually I'm really just looking to get deep slate right now. I'm not not too keen on diamonds. Um, well, I am keen on diamonds. I'm always keen on diamonds. But um, I've been mining a little bit, and I've struck lava twice, but here I found more diamonds, and this looks like it might be a big vein, so... oh, I was so hoping that block would also be diamonds. But hey, you know... Beggars can't be choosers, and three diamonds are still better than none. That's five more. On top of the six we have... Uh, I literally just... My brain just died, and I couldn't put five and six together. It's eleven! It's eleven. Yeah. I'm just gonna keep going. And even more diamonds! I, I barely went, like, twenty blocks, I think. Let's just see. Yeah, here it is. Okay, maybe it was like 22 blocks, but still, it's right here. That That's really cool. Um, 
grab these guys again it looks like three only three yeah and that there just in case anyone's curious is why i mine on negative 58 for my diamonds is because in one level lower you start seeing bedrock on the floor and every bedrock block you see is one block less where you can get diamonds so i, I like to be on here you know um, in my head, that kind of logic makes sense. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Hey! Okay, we just broke our last iron pickaxe. No way am I going to use any of those stone pickaxes to dig out deep slate. I'll use them for something else at some point. But for now, I think we've got a good amount of deep slate here with us. My friends, I think... Whoops, that, this button. I think it's time for us to roll some music and get the time lapse going as we build our starter house. Yeah. Let's go. Well, I think that is just grand. I really like this. I'm a big fan of this. I didn't think I'd like the acacia as much as I do. It is a very stark block, I'm not gonna lie. But I think it works. I'm definitely not gonna be building every house out of acacia, but it works quite well with the blackstone. The blackstone? Blackstone? Deep slate. I'm an idiot with the deep slate. I also built a little well that I don't think was included in the time lapse. I like these, they're just a 2x2 two two set of stairs, and if I... Can I? No, I can't. I, uh, it, it works, I promise. Take my word for it. But, what we have here is basically... No, wrong button. What I envisioned this being is kind of a, a house, right? This is our house, but then this is a delivery point, a hoist that brings things up from the mines, from this excavated area over here, which might become a bit of a quarry down the line. Not today, not in this episode, but I like it. It, it looks really cool. It, gonna, it needs more decorating, uh, but again, not in this episode. For today, I think we're kind of, kind of getting towards the end here, but let me give you a quick tour. I've done a brief interior. It's nothing fancy. I don't have a lot to work with. Literally, I transferred all my stuff in and um, yeah, I, I have 10 chests worth of organization at the moment. But this is what we got. We got a bunch of chests. I think these, this is quite a large amount of chests. Should last us a little while until we need a big storage room. We've got a crafting and or smelting area back here. Up the staircase. Very simple, just a bed, right? A place to set our spawn and leave said bed so that it is always in place for us. And, um, yeah, up here, I want to do some kind of winch mechanism, like a big lever or something, but I don't quite know what or how just yet. So I think I'll think on that in the future. But, um, yeah, here we've got this little platform, so, like, people hand things back and forth, and I, I like it. I think it looks really, really cool. I think, though, that this is a pretty decent place for us to end the episode. To call it quits here... It took me a little longer to build this thing than I thought it would just because I had absolutely no idea what I was doing. I didn't really have a vision or an idea going into it, just knew that I needed a starter house. Um, so I think I'm running a little low on time in getting this video made. So we're gonna call it, yeah. Um, 
If you guys have enjoyed the episode, this is the first episode of the series, which means it's a very important episode. So if you've gotten this far, please, please do consider leaving a like, a comment, any comment, a smiley face or a thumbs up, doesn't matter. It helps out the series and the channel and the YouTube algorithms and the things more than you know, and it would be greatly appreciated. Until the next episode, though, have an absolutely brilliant one, my friends. And goodbye.